first of all you have to create the composition name it as saber and choose the resolution about 1080p 10 second of duration with background color black now create new text and I'm naming it as fire intro select any font for it and uh, then right click on the text and create mask from the text now you can see here the, the text is converted into the mask so it is the automatic conversion of the text into the mask you can pre-compose it and make sure it is move all attributes to the new composition name it as loco comp and press ok now move to the effects and presets panel and search for the plugin saber and drop it over the logo comp if you can't see this effects and presets panel you can move to the window and select it from here now there are some changes that you have to do to make it look like fire select from the piece preset now there are few settings that you have to do from the preset panel you have to select the energy change the glow intensity to about 42.0 change the glow spread to 0.13 glow bias to 0.76 core size to 2.0 now move to the customize core and changes to layer mask now move into the logo comp copy the mask and paste it on logo comp now you have uh, you are seeing that there are too much uh, brightness what you have to do now what you have to do you have to key the start offset and the end offset keyframe it click on these icons make sure that you are on the first frame and uh, the start offset is at 0 and the at end offset is as 100 now change the holo intensity to about 237 and the holo size to about 360 and change the core softness to about 0 0.9 I'm just closing this mask off button now move to distortion then to glow distortion change the distortion amount to about maybe 136 and the distortion type to smoke and the composite to multiply yeah now it's looking better make sure that checkbox is and uh, when spread speed to about 153 and then change the noise speed to about zero yes make sure that it is zero noise scale to about maybe around 367 and noise base to 0.79 now it's looking better change the motion blur to about 0.25 this will add some blur make it look more real now uh, close this core distortion and open the core distortion change the change the distortion amount to about 10.9 distortion type to fluid and uh, wind speed to 0.66 change the noise speed to about 0.25 and noise scale to about 
117.1 change the noise by base to about 1.83 now close this distortion and move back to the customize score again now what we are going to do we are going to keyframe our animation our settings has been successfully converted now we are going to keyframe it so that we can animate it make sure on the first frame uh, that it is 100 percent okay and uh, what i'm going to do i'm going to open uh, our keyframe so we can look that and about uh, uh, on five second change the start offset to zero percent uh, now it will animate from empty to fire full full fire fire uh, text animation will be animated till five seconds now to close this fire what we have to do uh, press you and you will open the keyframes you can see the keyframes or yes you can see the keyframes now again keyframe the end offset here and now from the hundred percent we are going to convert to the end of the animation to zero percent yes now it will close out the fire intro first from the zero to five second it will uh, it will fade in it will animate from uh, closing what I say I can say I don't know so apology for my English from 0 to 5 second the fire will be created and from 5 second to the 10th second the fire will be gone yes that's how we can say so uh, how it will look you can you can now export it by moving to the file and then render it uh, if you want to know how to render the composition you can find the link in the description i will create the detailed video how to create the render this is how our uh, video is gonna look like uh, if you want to know how if you want to uh, create some complex fire animation i'm going to create another tutorial soon about how to create the 3d uh, fire intro this fire intro will be converted on 3d on 3d look and we also bring some logos in it and how we can move if you want to know how uh, this fire text animation can be created uh, through logos then comment below i will create uh, another video for that logo too thank you very much for watching our videos please make sure to subscribe our video we will create intros and uh, after effect editing skills videos soon thank you very much